Hello everyone, welcome back. All right, it is, it's only 6.30 and it is already dark out tonight. Anyways, I got everything ready. Uh, I'm not gonna waste too much time, hopefully. I'm wearing uh, my inner layer, my mid layers in the um, paneer bag and also, I got the lights on, and I already have my, if you could already check it out, I have my carbonated water and my little backpack, so let's close that up. So it's already night. <laughs> it's, uh, we're one hour behind on the fallback, and so... Anyways, let's get going. I got the lights turned on so we could do some recording. I got the Insta 361 on the helmet mount this time. Let's see how that works out. I got it set at. Oh, let's turn the let's turn the red power bikes on and turn the red power bikes light on. All right. Fresh battery. Oh. All right. Oh, you know what I forgot to do? I forgot to turn the rear lights on. Uh, before I forget, let's turn the rear lights on. And then I gotta turn my helmet light on as well. So, hold on. Let's just, uh, I'm gonna have to, re I'm gonna have to adjust it. Adjust it right now. Okay. Alright, let's just get going now. I don't want to get too late. Even though I'm not late, I feel like I'm late. I feel like I'm late. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna cut through the shortcut. Even though most likely that's going to. Uh... Be a little bumpy for me. All right. All right, I'm feeling good. So it's dark both ways. Dark going to the clubhouse and dark coming back. It's going to be a nice. Uh, it it was it feels warm right now. It's probably like in the 60s, upper 60s. That's why I'm not. Uh, I'm wearing uh, my mid layer. I'm wearing my inner layer, training pants. I am wearing compression tights. They're black. I don't know if that makes any difference, but anyways. There's a fan right here. Amazon. How you doing, Amazon? Amazon Prime. I'm an Amazon Prime member, by the way. I'm actually very happy to be an Amazon Prime member. I'm actually listening to Amazon Prime music right now. Listening to the listening to them on my Power Beats Pro. All right, it gets a little bumpy here, so I'm gonna have to stand up a little bit. Oh, they cut the grass, nice. So I'm standing up a little bit. Or what happens is that it jostles the helmet, and then it jostles the light. And the light starts coming down. All right. Oh, looks like they're doing some construction work here. Uh, crap. Uh, let's just go over the grass. Let's see if I can go over the grass. Oh, yeah, I did. All right. Whew. That was unexpected. Alright. Alright, I got the Insta 361 on the handlebar mount. I got uh I got another one on the chest mount, both at 40 or 60 frames per second. At a lower resolution, but it still comes out pretty good, I think. And then 
I have uh, the Insta 361X on the uh, helmet. And that's at 4K at 50 frames per second. And I have it more manual setting on it. I had to lower it one bracket. I, I, and I use the, uh, the smartphone to uh, adjust, the, adjust the setting manually. I'm going to have to do that all the time because I think it's too overexposed. I adjust it down one stop, sometimes more than one stop, but at night I think one stop is good. Sometimes the lights are overexposed. So, try to turn that down, especially the light on the, the red power bike light pointing down. So I have the setting on fast, the shutter speed fast. ISO is going to be auto, but it's probably going to be a high ISO. Anyways, I probably have to lower the uh, exposure anyway. And then... And that's, that's it. That's all I do. And I get that started on the phone. So I'm able to actually get a, to see it beforehand. So that's kind of cool. Takes a little bit more time. Now if I compare that to the Insta 361, I just start it and go. You know, there's not too much manual settings I can do. But the settings, how they are right now, they seem to work pretty good my opinion. That's my opinion though. Oh, it's in the 60s, but it feels really good, actually. I've been uh, a little acclimated to the uh, cold weather lately. I've been dealing with uh, 30, upper 30 degrees. I think it was uh, four, maybe four or five days ago. The temperature dropped to the 30s, or in the mid 30s overnight. My house, inside the house, was uh, 50, about 58, 56 degrees. That was cold in, in the house. Jeez. Anyways, what am I complaining for? That's nothing. Some people feel, some people have to deal with uh, more than that in other places. I am wearing my safety tinted glasses just because, you know, when you ride with uh, lights, head-mounted headlights, the bugs start coming out and flying towards your face. I think I have a video. I actually caught it on camera. I caught a, what a, a I guess a beetle. Bees passage. Okay, I almost, I almost skipped my, my exit. <laughs> I almost skipped my exit. Jeez. Yeah, you know, riding at night is really different. It's like your eyes plays tricks on you. I almost skipped my, uh, my turn out here. Oh, what is that? I don't know what that was. Something in the middle of the road. I forgot what I was even talking about. Gotta look around. Gotta be more vigilant. Maybe take a little bit slower. Not be so fast. Anyways. Oh. I think I was talking. Oh, possum! It's all possum. Yeah, you <laughs> creatures come out at night, you know, I mean, it's good to have a lot of lights if possible so you, so you can see things. Uh, what was I talking about? I wanted to say something before I got distracted. Anyways, oh well. 
I'm headed to Monday Night Football. It's gonna be Cowboys and the Giants in New York. I left uh, on time, 6.30, although it feels like 7.30, but uh, it is 6.30, it's fall back. Anyways, feels good, feels really good. I got acclimated to the colder weather and now this nice 60 degrees riding at night is uh, very comfortable. I'm wearing mostly black and the pants I'm wearing has uh, reflectors at the ankle towards in the back. They're like uh, they're like uh, training pants for joggers. And they got zippers at the ankle because it t the pants tapers down to the ankle, which is perfect because you don't want your pants to get caught up in the uh, in the chain. So that's why I wear these these particular training pants. Plus they got reflectors in the back. Small strip, but still something. The bike itself has uh, reflectors in the front, on the bag, the front bag, or the large bag. Doesn't matter if it's in the front or bag. And I got a small bag that also has reflectors. The paneer bag has reflectors. I have a, a high visibility vest on that is actually a body armor, bulletproof or bullet resistant. Level two, I didn't get a level three. And it has some chain mail, so. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Look at that. Oh. Got to be careful. I, I didn't even know they were doing any work here. Just goes to show you got to you got to take it easy. My brakes are a little loose, uh, but they're still workable. No, I a little loose, but uh, that's all right. Anyways, Phew. Uh, I'm glad they're working on the on the sidewalk here, but geez, I can barely see that at night. Although, granted, I have my uh, safety tinted glasses on, but still. Oh, I see something crawling right here. What is that, a possum? Another possum? Uh, possum? I think they're possums. They're not armadillos. Armadillos have like a different uh, body coating. They have more like a scaly skin, I think. This is a possum, they're more furry. I can see their eyes being lit up. So yeah, I've got the head helmet mounted headlight. I got the two handlebar mounts. I should really uh, slow down, especially when I'm on the sidewalk because you never know what's out here. Okay, let's see what we got today. that time where everybody's coming home too so man I, I probably slow down a little bit I'm seeing a lot of hazards here if I didn't have all this gear and don't forget your helmet of course but if I didn't have all this gear I probably would not ride this fast uh, because there's no way I could see this far enough there's just no way I could see this far enough. And I live here, and I know, <laughs> I know, I know the uh, the area, and I'm and I'm still kind of you know, I still you can you can get disoriented at night, you know. So and plus there's possums out here. There might be some people. I don't see any people, but uh, 
I got my helmet, uh, I got the, uh, the handlebar or the uh, helmet headlight, helmet mounted headlight uh, aimed up a little bit higher so I can see down further. Now usually here, I'm gonna, uh, usually the traffic kind of thins out here so I'm gonna just follow this bike here. cut in front of someone, but that's alright, they can go around. Uh, anyways, I'd rather ride on the, uh, I'd rather ride on the street right now because it thins out here a lot, so, and I could go a little, I could probably pedal fast or go a little faster. I see like there's people on the sidewalk. I saw some people on the sidewalk right there. Oh, yellow light. Come on, I can make it. Made it. All right. Feeling good. Woo. All right. So. Anyways. Night riding, very different. I guess if you rode a motorcycle, you would be used to this kind of stuff. I don't, I've never ridden a motorcycle, so I can't, I can't really tell you whether it's, uh, whether it's normal or anything. I don't, I don't know. I just don't want to go to the turnaround. It takes longer. I can beat all those cars. If I can beat these cars, I'm good. Ugh. Yes, I beat them. All right. Now I can get here. Now they can go around. So I can't compare. I've never ridden a motorcycle. I never ridden a motorcycle at night. So, but I'm, I'm assuming if you've ridden a motorcycle at night, it'd be very similar. There is a slight difference, though, in that I could ride on the sidewalk. My lighting is limited. You know, I don't have a motor to run off the alternator that charges the battery. Then the battery would charge your, your headlights be a lot brighter. Anyway, here we are. Gonna order some pizza. Oh, man, I haven't been eating. I haven't eaten a whole day. I ate a little, a little bit here, a little bit there. Because I know I was gonna go watch Monday Night Football and eat pizza, hot wings, salad. Yeah. Anyways, time for me to signal. Gear down, pedal assist down, gear down to three. Whew. <sighs> nice and cool. I'm glad I didn't wear the mid layer. I just wore the inner layer. Maybe later tonight I'll wear the mid layer. It might get a little bit colder than what it is now. So, but it's not going to get that much colder, so we'll see. All right. Whew. See you later. Bye. Like, share, subscribe, give a comment.